Sometimes external hard drives may not show up properly in your Mac OS and can sometimes be unusable. This issue can happen even with brand new external hard drives. As we check the disk utility tool on Mac OS, the drive will either show up as grayed out with the name like disk 2 s one or disk utility will give you an error when trying to reformat the drive. In this video, we show you a special command you can use to fix your external hard drive or thumb drive and reformat it so it can be used with your Mac or any other device. You'll first want to open up the disk utility tool. We can easily do so from the finder, through the applications folder, and inside of the utilities folder. Once you have the disk utility tool up, go ahead and select your external hard drive from the list and simply hit the info button. We simply need to make sure that we have the actual disk number. So please keep this in mind as we'll need this for the special command that we'll use. With the disk number in mind, you'll want to go ahead and open up your terminal application through the utilities folder so we can type in our special command and force the external hard drive to be reformatted. In the terminal application, we'll want to go ahead and type in a special command to reformat your external hard drive or thumb drive. I'll explain each part of the command as we proceed here. Also, if you need to copy the command, we have also included it in the description of this video. Please remember that this command must be typed in exactly as you see it here. The first two parts of the command are always necessary as we're telling the system to erase or reformat your external hard drive, SD card, or thumb drive. The next part of the command indicates the format that we're looking to select for that external disk. Now you can select which format that you want to put it in depending on what you're looking to use this disk for. Depending on what you're looking to use this external disk for, you have different formats to choose from. If you plan on using this disk only with Mac computers, you'll want to use the JHFS Plus format, which is common for Macs. JHFS Plus puts the disk in the Mac OS Extended Journal format. HFS Plus puts the disk into the regular Mac OS Extended format. FAT32 puts the disk into the MS-DOS format, which will allow it to be used with Windows computers. XFAT puts the disk into the XFAT format, which, of course, can also be used with Windows computers. For the next part of the command, we're simply choosing what name we want for the external hard drive. While we've chosen backup for the name of our external hard drive, you can of course choose whatever name that you would like for this disk. The last part of the command is the most important because we're telling the computer which external hard drive needs to be erased and reformatted. You do not want to end up reformatting the wrong hard drive and losing any data, which once again is why we need to keep in mind of the disk number of your external hard drive. Once you've chosen the format and name for your disk and typed it into terminal, just press the return key on your keyboard and the system will proceed to reformat the drive. Terminal will show the message of when the drive is successfully erased and you can proceed with using your external disk as normal. 